Hello there, this is going to be a quick video on how to find the price of an item with tax. Um, in Ontario, which is uh, where I live, it's 13%, just about for everything. Um, it's pretty expensive. So uh, what we're going to do here is just quickly figure out how do you find the tax on an item. And uh, let's, let's get right to the question here. It says, a pair of shoes cost $95 before tax. Ontario charges 13% tax. What will you pay for the shoes, including tax? Okay. Well, start by writing $95 down. And um, assuming you've watched the videos on how to change a percent into a decimal, I'm going to jump right in to doing that right now. We're going to change 13% into a decimal. What that means is you're moving the decimal over two places over to the left. Okay. So you end up getting 0.13. 13% as a decimal is 0.13. And on your calculator, um, you would just go uh, 95 times 0.13, and we get 12.35. 12 12.35, which is really $12.35. So that's how much tax we're going to pay. It would be a mistake to stop here because this is how much tax we're paying. But the question said, what will you pay for the shoes, including tax? So we take $95, which is the original amount for the shoes, and we add on what we found was the tax, which was $12. Whoops, that's a terrible looking three. $12.35. And if we add those two up on a calculator or in our head, we get $107.35. Okay, that's the total price with tax right there. That's the answer we were looking for. Um, the next question is, wow, the, the pair of shoes still cost $95. But in this case, it says Alberta, which is another province here in Canada, charges 5% tax. That's a lot lower than 13% tax. So how do you write that as a decimal? Well, once again, you move the decimal over two places, and it will look like this. And we're going to multiply. Okay, the decimal always starts here on a regular number. And moving it two to the left, you have to put a zero in there so that you can do that. So you get 0 0.05. That zero right here is just there. You don't really need it when you type it in on your calculator. You probably knew that already. So we're going to go 95 times 0 0.05 or 0 0.05. You get $4.75. And so, do you remember what to do? You take the $95 that we had originally, we add up $4.75. So let's do that here. And you get $99.75. That's the total price with tax. There is a faster way to do that, but I'm going to let this little video be done and uh, show you how to do a faster way uh, on the next video. Okay, take care.